Hi guys and welcome to my Christmassy evening routine. So I always aim to finish work around 5.30 and then the first thing I do is always eat dinner. I'm always super hungry but tonight I'm lucky because dinner is made for me. As you can see I've just gone for garlic bread and pasta, a real easy meal in the evening. I love all the carbs so for me this is an absolute go-to meal. I just take this time to catch up on my phone and see what I've missed throughout the day. And then of course I eat all my dinner because I'm always super hungry. Because it is that festive time of year I either spend my evenings writing Christmas cards because I'm super last minute or wrapping presents so tonight I'm catching up on last minute Christmas cards that I should have written a lot sooner. And then as soon as I'm done I lay my pyjamas out ready to get cosy and have a nice warm bath. These pyjamas and slippers are both from Primark and I absolutely love them. As you can tell, they are my Christmassy pyjamas and I always like to get them laid out on my bed before I go ahead and have a bath. I just feel like there's nothing better than getting out of a bath and having clean, cosy pyjamas. Next up for me, it's bath time. I always love lighting the candles and I love having a good bubble bath. It's just my favourite thing to do regardless of whether we're in summer or winter. I always use it for a little bit of me time and have a little pamper to myself. I feel like it's the one time during the day that I can spend relaxing and just winding down for the evening. So as you can see, I always light more candles and just make it a super relaxing environment. it wouldn't be a cosy bubble bath without a bath bomb. This one I picked up from Boots and I absolutely love it. Bath bombs just add something to the bath and they just make me feel so much more relaxed and they always smell amazing. So I always just let this fizz around for a while. It always looks so pretty before I get in the bath and wind down. I managed to get my hands on the Lush Snow Fairy Shower Gel Oh my goodness, it smells amazing. I always pop a little bit of this on just to make my skin smell amazing. And to be honest, I'm obsessed. I only picked this up today and I am so in love with it. As you can see, I just go ahead and rub it all in and just make my skin smell really, really nice and fresh. <laughs> For me personally, whenever I use a bath bomb and loads of bubble bath in my bath, I prefer to do my skincare when I get out of the bath. That is just because my skin is quite sensitive. Um, so I go in with the Garnier Micellar Cleansing Water and I use that to get off my eye makeup and the base to my face makeup. This is quite a long process for me. Um, I tend to try and take my time taking off my face makeup and my eye makeup. But I have sped it up a little bit for you because it did take me a little while. I then go in with my Elemis Superfood Cleanser and I absolutely love this. I normally pop two pumps on my hand and then I gently place around my face with a little bit of water to lather it up slightly. This is one of the best feelings ever. I love having a fresh face and taking all my makeup off and knowing that my skin is nice and clean. I absolutely love this range and I've only recently just started using it. I then make sure that my skin is patted dry slightly, ready for my moisturiser. I then go in with the Elemis Superfood Moisturiser. This feels so nice on the skin and it also smells amazing. I just rub it in so that it's nice and clear and it also gives me a chance for my skin to feel moisturised before bed. Now, at the moment, I love a good hot chocolate in the evening, but this evening I wanted something to go with that. Normally I tuck into the celebrations, but I felt like something a little bit more substantial and so of course I wanted to decorate gingerbread men. This is actually my first time and I'm not going to lie, the resources were pretty limited so 
please don't judge the design because it is pretty laughable even if I do say so myself but oh my goodness they taste amazing <laughs> So here we are with my gingerbread and now it's time to make a hot chocolate, my favourite thing in the world. So I always go for the Whisper hot chocolate, guys it's amazing. Of course I have mini marshmallows because it wouldn't be a hot chocolate without. And I also added the addition of these hotel chocolate milk chocolate drops. And then of course whipped cream. And then I serve that in my favourite Poundland mug which I think is adorable. <laughs> So now my hot chocolate is ready to go, I'm now going to go ahead and have a little movie night. This is one of my favourite things to do, especially around Christmas time. I just love watching all the Christmas films and so of course tonight was no different. And tonight I wanted to go ahead and watch Miracle on 34th Street. It is one of my favourite films and I love just getting all cosy on the sofa with all the Christmas lights on before bed. This is my favourite thing to do and something that I just do to wind down on an evening. And then after I finish watching a film I then head into the bedroom and I usually get into bed and scroll on Instagram or TikTok. I'm not going to lie, if I'm on TikTok it's dangerous because I feel that I can sometimes be on there for like an hour or two without realising but generally I just try and wind down. Um, I don't like to spend too much time on my phone but I'll have a quick look or catch up on any messages that I've missed and set my alarm for the next day and things like that. So nothing too exciting, I just like getting all cosy just before I'm about to go to sleep. Sometimes I will read a book, but that's not happening tonight. I'm just gonna have a little catch up and then I'm gonna wind down and go to sleep. And there we have my Christmassy evening routine. I really hope you guys enjoyed and I would appreciate it if you would give this video a massive thumbs up if you did. And I will see you in one of my next videos.